Hi there, have we met? My name is Catherine and I am the creative director and CEO at Resin Obsession. And I want to show you a trick today to help you deal with resin edges on your pieces. So this is a bracelet I made recently and there's an edge on this and I wanna show you guys a trick to fix this edge without having to sand. So it's perfectly normal when you use a resin mold to get an edge on the edge of your resin pieces. So this is a, a bracelet I made recently and the edge or the part that was down near the mold is perfectly smooth. This is this the, um, side here that was touching the mold, but the part that was facing up has an edge. And this comes from the resin shrinking a smidge while it cools. So you you pour the resin into your mold and it sticks to the sides of the mold. And then as it cools, that center portion that's not stuck to the side will shrink a little, but the other part stays up next to the edge of the mold. And it's a, it's a physics surface tension thing. Anyway, it's completely normal for that to happen. However, you do want to do something about it because like in the case of this bracelet, this edge is a little sharp and it's not super comfortable to wear. So there are two ways to handle it. One is you could sand this edge down and soft and make it smooth. But the problem with that is you're not gonna have a perfectly even bracelet on both sides. So one side will still be rounded, but this other side will be flat. So what we can do right now is use this edge to our advantage. And I'm gonna show you how to use the Resin Obsession Crystal Doming Resin to fill in that edge. Okay, so I've mixed some of the Resin Obsession Crystal Doming Resin. This resin mixes one to one by volume and it mixes thick. And that's what we're gonna to use to our advantage because we've got a nice edge here and we've got a trough in the center. And so all I'm gonna do is use a toothpick to very carefully dot resin in the center of this trough. Now you might be tempted to pour it in here, don't. <laughs> in fact, you might ought to lay off the coffee. But I'm gonna go ahead and finish filling this in. And then I will check it for bubbles, set it aside to cure for 24 hours, and then we'll take a look and see what's going on. So let's take a look at the bracelet and you can see how very nicely the dome filled in or the doming resin filled in the ridge in the resin. So you can, if you look closely, you can still see, or you can still maybe, you know, oh my gosh, it looks like a little something, but I gotta tell you, if you, I mean, if you didn't know this is what you were looking for, I don't think you would, you would know. And you know what's perfect about this? no sanding. So if you're like me and you dislike sanding, this is another trick to have in your arsenal of ways to fix that resin edge. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe to this channel so you can know when more Resin Obsession videos get posted. And the next time you need supplies for your resin project, come on over to resinobsession.com. We love helping creative people make something gorgeous with resin.